eternal Lord God, who alone spreads out the heavens and rules the raging of the sea. We thank you for this nation conceived in liberty and dedicated to the proposition that all human beings are created equal. We come today to pay our respects to the memory of George Floyd, Ahmad Arbery, and Breonna Taylor. We come today, O oh God, to stand in solidarity with courageous Americans who are peacefully protesting against racial injustice across our nation. We come today to acknowledge that injustice anywhere is a threat to justice everywhere. We come, Lord, because we believe that the American people are wrapped in a blanket of mutuality and tied to a single garment of destiny. We come with hope in our hearts because we know that right defeated is better than evil triumphant. We come, mighty God, most of all, because we know that behind the dim unknown, you stand within the shadows, keeping watch above your own. Lord, we have trusted in you throughout the seasons of our nation's life and have been constantly aware of your unfailing love. Our nation and world are in pain, feeling overwhelmed by multiple crises that require your love, wisdom, and power. We come today because you have told us in Psalm 4610, be silent and know that I am God. I will be honored by every nation and I will be honored throughout the world. We come to honor you. We pray in your sovereign name. Amen. George Floyd was born and raised in Houston, Texas. To his friends and loved ones, he is known as Floyd. He was a high school athlete playing both basketball and football a tight end. His family wants him to be remembered, not for his death, but for being family-oriented, loving, and godly. He passed away at 46 years old. For eight minutes and 46 seconds, Officer Derek Siobhan held his knee on George Floyd's neck. As he kneeled on his neck, as he yelled, I can't breathe, I can't breathe, and called for his mother. Today, we gather here in solemn reverence to not just mark his tragic death, but to give honor to his life. We now will pause for eight minutes and 46 seconds in remembrance of George Floyd.
George Floyd, Ahmaud Arbery, Breonna Taylor, may we honor those dead by protecting all who are alive.